Good morning, shin shiners and possibly shin shaders and anyone else in between. I think that's just how I'm going to open things from now on. And since we're still running on generator power, um, I'm going to take a trip to Newington or maybe the end of Dover, which has power, and go to uh, Panera, one of the two Paneras in those two places. And hopefully their wireless internet is working. Otherwise... Dover, please get your power up by midnight tonight for this half of Dover. I need to get my vlog up. Well, now we're at Panera and hopefully I can get the vlog uploaded. Well, it looks like I can't upload it because I only get a half an hour, um, of internet time and I have 19 minutes left and when I canceled the upload it said it would take like 86 minutes to upload the video and it also put the wrong vlog number trying to fix that uh, it put the wrong vlog number in the video so I have to go home and edit that and hopefully our internet comes back up soon well uh, that was a total bust if Irene hadn't killed the internet um, I could have uploaded this, so, so not counting those four days at the beginning of the countdown in California, this might be the first day where I don't upload before midnight, considering that Dover doesn't get its internet back on by uh, this evening, which is possible. I mean, half of Dover had it. Go somewhere that, for that dinner stuff. that has internet. Yeah, I guess, but darn you, Irene, why'd you have to kill the internet? Irene's an internet murderer. Now we're at one of the uh, most interesting stores and biggest I think I've ever been in uh, my whole entire life. I've come here not so often anymore, but I used to come here a lot. It's uh, BJ's, but everything is in bulk. It's awesome. You can like stock up for like a month on one shopping trip, theoretically. Huh. Turns out I actually had the correct vlog number. Um, Yesterday was the 83rd vlog, but looking at the at the one before it, my money, which I believe I might have been editing at late at night, so that's probably why I missed it, is um also is the 81, 81st vlog, but so is the one before it. God, I can't do anything about it because I'm not at Panera, and the internet is still not working at my house. I guess today is going to be a complaint about the internet day. Darn you, Irene. Like I'm talking to a real person, but really it's just a force of nature. Gah, I'm already editing the stuff I filmed today, and I haven't even uploaded yesterday. Woo, it's a vlog apocalypse. Get like apocalypse. Why am I explaining the jokes? Funny, well, or not funny, as they stand. <sighs> well, still running on generator power, and uh, still having to upload the vlog. And so today, all I've done is try to get the vlog uploaded. So pretty much, it's like an extension of yesterday today, because normally I uploaded in the morning and move on but today I've been stuck on it because the stupid power internet and cable Ugh, Irene the generator just turned off time to go see if there's internet and if there is I can finally upload the vlog it's a miracle to want to jinx it internet wow I rely way too much on that for entertainment Yes! Yes, we do! Alrighty. <sighs> Took it long enough. Now, to upload that vlog. The best part was, like, literally seconds before the power came back on, I was like, Mom, when's the power gonna come back on? So I'm glad it came back on. This is definitely a first, for me at least. I'm putting an apple slice on my burger. My mom says that it should be good, or hopes it'll be good. I'm the first to try it, I believe, in the house. It's uh, it was strangely good. It's kind of like when you put pineapple on pizza, adds that sort of like 
tanginess to it because pineapples are like sourish. This is a sourish apple. I guess it would be different if we used a sweeter apple. This is a pink crisp apple that I used. I don't know. Not only really sure it's the perfect thing to put on your burger, but it was interesting. Also, the burger had meatloaf seasoning in it, which just added to the uh, interesting amalgam of flavors in my mouth. You know, in the past couple of days, I haven't said awkward cut at all. So, in fact, so my brother, before we left, like before I even started vlogging, kept claiming that he read somewhere that if you plug your nose and um, eat an apple and plug your nose and eat an onion, they'll taste very similar or at least exactly the same. So, Mom, can you record this for a second? It's already recording. Just take, just take the book for me. Okay. So, um, apple. Ah. Okay. And smaller piece of onion. About equal size to that bite. Okay. Didn't taste like an onion when I first ate it. Now that I've swallowed it. Get the aftertaste of an onion. Because your nose isn't plugged anymore. Yeah. Anyway, I guess that does prove that they taste very similar if you plug your nose. I almost forgot to bring you to a uh, Golix, a uh, local, not only really local, huh? is it? It might be a uh, multiple place, multiple shop place, but I don't know. Anyways, I almost forgot to bring you guys um, to Golix. And like my mom calls me, I come downstairs, I feel the pouch in my waist where I keep the camera, and I go, up, oh, camera. Now we're going. Yeah, I sort of didn't know we were going somewhere else. I thought we were going to um, Golix. So now we're in downtown Portsmouth because we tried to go to, what was the place called? Ice House. Ice House, but it was closed, I, I assume, because power outages and whatnot. So he's parked at the temple that we are members of. And now we're walking to some place in Market Square that's hopefully open, and we're gonna have, uh, gonna have some gelato, goodness and whatnot, and such and such. Doesn't the way the light lands on that uh, church steeple make it look like it's animated? What? No, my mom. School starts on Wednesday. Tomorrow's Tuesday. Okay, no! That's not how I want to start this clip. <laughs> Anyways, uh, because we went out to ice cream, I'm not that anyone really cares. I care though. Um, I missed the first um, new premiered episode um, of uh, the Powerful Mondays on um, Sci Fi, which I believe it's Eureka. So if I turn the TV on relatively soon, I can watch, uh, considering the cable's back, I can watch Warehouse 13 and Alphas, and then immediately following that, they're going to re-premiere, not re-premiere, they're going to replay the uh, episode of Eureka. Well, good night, whoever's watching this. See you tomorrow. Well, I won't see you, but you will see me. And let's hope there's no more power outages anytime soon. There's a vlog on the web featuring Ben Stock that he shoots every day as he walks and talks. If you're Bigfoot in the woods or producers in LA, you should stop all your shit and watch Sunshine Shade. Sunshine Shade. Sunshine Shade. Has nothing to do with Florida, but it's great. If you can't wait, don't get irate. Just stay in your sheet, cause it's Sunshine Shade. Well, I won't see you, you will see me.